Hi, my name is Kristen and I'm from SixSisterStuff.com and today I am making No Bake Apple Delight. Now this is a pretty easy recipe, no baking involved, and so we're going to start. Um, the first thing you, you want to do is um, get two cans of um, apple pie filling, and my favorite is Lucky Leaf. That is one of my most favorites. Okay, so we're going to put pie filling aside. Then we're going to make a cream cheese filling. So what you need is just eight ounces of cream cheese, and we'll stick it in a bowl. Then you're going to add some powdered sugar and some about two tablespoons of some brown sugar, a teaspoon of cinnamon, a half a cup of milk, and I just use skim milk, but you can use whatever milk you want. If you want to use uh, whole milk, it will be a little bit creamier for you. And then also a container of some Cool Whip. Okay, so I'm going to mix these by hand for just a minute and then I'll get my handy dandy electric mixer and mix it really good. All right, we are ready. Okay, so you want to mix this for about two minutes until it starts getting a little bit creamy. So after you're done mixing that, um, it should be nice and creamy. A little bit thick, but not too thick. Okay, so then we're going to move some of our stuff aside. And this is where the fun part begins because we're going to do layers. So we're going to start by like a, a 9 by 13 pan. This is one's a little bit smaller, but it will still work just fine. So you just want to fill the bottom with graham crackers. It's okay if you overlap. You won't even be able to tell after a little while. Okay, so we have one layer down. So then you're going to take, rinse this off real quick, about a third of your apple filling, and you're just going to put it right onto your graham crackers. Okay, it doesn't have to be too pretty, but as long as it kind of pretty much covers the graham crackers, you're good. Okay, then. One sec, I'm going to wash my hands again. That pie filling is gooey. Okay, so now we're going to do about a third of our cream cheese frosting, or I guess filling. And I kind of just eyeball it. You don't really have to do exactly a third, but just as long as you get some in there. Okay. Then we're going to add just some Cool Whip on top. Again, about a third of that. A little bit more. Just kind of mix it all together. Then we're going to add um, a third of a cup of, these are toffee bits. And they are so good. And then we're going to start again. Get your graham crackers. And then your apple pie filling again. You know what this pan is actually smaller than I was expecting, so we're just going to do the rest of it. Um, usually with a normal 9 by 13 pan you can get three layers in, but today we're just going to do two. It kind of just depends on however you like it. Okay, then we're going to add our filling again. Spread it around. And then a little bit more Cool Whip on top. Cool Whip is one of my most favorite foods. 
I absolutely just love it. I can just eat it right out of the container. I love it more than just ice cream. I know some people think that's gross, <laughs> but I love it. Okay, so there's our Cool Whip. Then you're gonna add your toffee on top. Then my other favorite part is the caramel on top. You can usually get a spoon. I'm gonna actually just try and drizzle this on top, see how it goes. You can put as much or as little as you want. Um, I wanna say this is probably about three tablespoons or so. All right, there you go. So now all you're gonna do is you're gonna stick it in your fridge for about two hours to let the graham crackers get a little bit soggy and you are done. Thank you for joining me today. Um, if you wanna check out other amazing recipes like this one, you can check it out at sixsisterstuff.com. Thank you.